Blind bags, 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 blind bags. There were so many Halloween reviews that I wanted to get done this year. I have a lot of spooky toys to review. I ran out of days. I ran out of time. I ran out of energy. But I am going to do all of my spooky blind bags. I'm going to get them done. So I'm not going to blind choose them. I'm going to strategically choose them. Thank you guys for joining me today. It is great to see you here. <clears throat> Maybe I'll open up this thing as well because it's spooky and I'm going to need a place to put these things when I open them. However, I don't have my existing ones anywhere anywhere nearby that I can find them. I also have too many toys here in my lap that I'm trying to hide. I think I'll just get started here. These are the ones that I really want to look at. Thank you, Kaylay. Hi, Jenny. Thanks for stopping in. Hi, ex foodas Thanks for dropping in. Is there a tear tab on this? I don't need a tear tab. Who is my first pony I can get? Wait, should I pull up the checklist? Oh, here's the checklist. So, I think this is the Spooky Series number one. And these are the ones you can get. I got... Dun, dun, dun. Cheese... Oh, Mr. Carrot Cake. Mr. Carrot Cake? What kind of name is that? And he is dressed up like a scarecrow. Isn't that great? <laughs> he looks good. I love this Halloween My Little Pony series. Hey, Diamonds Dollies. Thanks for stopping in. Let's see what else we got here. Let's open up another one of these. Oh. My muscles are failing me. Ah. 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 Here we go. Ah, oh, spooky Andy is in the house. Welcome Andy. Ah, 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 ah. And we got Pinkie Pie dressed up as a Christmas cookie? I guess that's what she is. Looking cute. Not very spooky. Oh, wait. That's Mrs. Dazzle Cake. That's not even Pinkie Pie. <laughs> okay. My bad. Let's, um... Let's do a Monster High Mini. This is Series 1. This is all that we got in Canada. Everyone's correcting me. Yes, yes, I know it's Dazzle Cake. What is her Halloween costume? Hello, Mandy. I saw your costume. You looked great. Oh, let me pull out this checklist first. I'm not going to say. There's too many to guess which ones we're going to get. I don't know how many were in Series 1 initially. 
I'm pretty sure I didn't get this one. It's Rochelle as a superhero. Nice. That is a very spooky one. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, let's move on. Do I have anything else spooky in here? Oh. Should I do this one so far? No. Let's do more My Little Pony. I know that I got lots of those. Oh, this one's awesome. Do you guys know who this is? Spooky. I like her. Are those glasses? And her name is Raven Inkwell. She's a good one. <laughs> Noodle Moore in the house. Welcome, Noodle. Welcome, Kaisley Gray. Yeah, I'm liking these ponies. Let's do another pony. I hope I don't use all my ponies up, though. Mm. That might be my last... No, I've got lots of them. I don't know, no, but I'll do something else. I'll do another Monster High. Oh, there's a tear tab here. Hey, Aaron, thank you for stopping in. This is another... It's another superhero one. And it's, I didn't know that these were series one. I thought there were like eight that came in the first series. And this is superhero D D Draculaura. I'm assuming. Cute. Let's do this. Blind bag minion figure. Hey, if you haven't liked this video, why don't you give it a like right now? I don't see a tear tap on this either, but we don't need those here. And it's the non-spooky one <laughs> because for the Halloween series of these minion characters, you can get one of two. You can get a vampire or a firefighter. What does that mean? Why? All right, let me put them together. They put the arms and that's good because I hear people complaining a lot about the arms. Goggles have this really cool elastic piece. I love that. You plop those on like that. And then you put his body into... Oh, you have to take the arms off to get this pants on. Oh, what a jip. Why would they even do that then? Welcome, Benedict. You missed some ponies, but I will definitely review them. The worst part about blind bag videos is watching somebody put together a toy when you can't even see them putting it together. What does this say? Argos, the young man in the pub. My name is Harley Quinn. Nice to meet you. <laughs> oh, oh. I'm here. Hey, Beep Naw. Thanks for stopping in. Your face tattoo video was funny. Kind of a disaster, but it really turned out... I don't know how such a disaster could turn out so well in the end. I like to see the ponies. All right, maybe I can rehatch the ponies really quickly. I'm still putting together this minion, which is proving quite difficult. 
It's really a silly Halloween costume, let me tell ya. <clears throat> Hat was hard to get in. The best part is the jack-o'-lantern for sure. I think I put his arms on. I don't know how you know if you put their arms on the wrong way or not. The minions are so cute. They're all right. They're a bit silly for my liking. But I do like these mega block ones. Look at that jack-o'-lantern. I don't know what kind of noises they make. More like beep That's probably the worst minion impression that anybody has ever done. I haven't really seen. I saw I think the first two movies once. Did any kids visit you for candy? It's not Halloween yet, dude. Halloween probably happened to you because you're way over in that hemisphere. Halloween doesn't happen for till I don't know, another 24 hours. All right. What else do we got in here? Anything? Oh, we got more spooky. I guess I should have got more of these monster hires. I thought I had them all. Hey, Lewis, thanks for stopping in. Um, I don't think I have this one either. It looks like it's Bedtime Venus. Pretty darn cute. Oh, yeah, I was going to review those ponies for the latecomers. So we got carrot cake. And we got some kind of other cake. So two cakes. And then we got this one, which is my favorite of the ponies, because she looks a little creepier. And these are the monster hires that we got so far. Two superheroes and a bedtime Venus. All right, let's do another pony. Arr, arr. Venus looks like Jennifer. Oh, it is Jennifer. Noodles, noodles on the case. Look at her gold skin. Thank you, thank you, Noodle, for not letting me get away with murder. And we get this pony. Some crazy unicorn purple blue thing. I don't know what kind of costume that is. And it's Minuet. And she is always on time. So is she Minute or Minuet? Okay, more. What else spooky do I have in here? Anything else spooky? Anybody calling out anything here? Anybody want to see? I don't recognize the white pony. The white pony is Raven Inkwell. Hmm. Anything else spooky in here? I mean, genies are kind of spooky, but I think I might save those. Shopkins are kind of spooky. My, my, my mini Mixicues are spooky. Blind ones in here? Yeah, let's open this My Mini Mixi Cube because they do have costumes on. Let's do that. I don't think I have any Lego monsters. 
I have Lego Christmas. I've got... Are these Lego monsters? I don't even know what this is. Here's some garbage. Care Bears, are they spooky? Miles from Tomorrowland. From Little Shop of Horrors. Oh, I have to put up my mask, it's hurting my forehead. I hope, uh, hope this isn't more scary. Never seen that one before. Hey, and my voice isn't as scary. Well, at least it sounds scarier when I have the mask on, to me. Okay, let's see what's in this My Mini mix -Acues. Thank you, Darren. Thanks for stopping in. Now, does anyone know if the Monster High ones are out yet? That's a pretty cool surprise. And how can I get those Monster High ones? How do you get them? Look at these guys. So, there's a little girl with a skunk outfit. And there's a little boy with a... It's like a Clockwork Orange outfit. And you take them, <laughs> it's a little boy, and you stick them down inside. And they have sleeveless shirts on. And then, <laughs> is that a skunk? I don't know if it's a skunk. Maybe it's a raccoon. And wait, is this, is this an old man? And why does this old man have lipstick on and batty eyelashes very clockwork orange or maybe he's just a proper old man with an iPhone in his hand I have gray hair am I an old man And then we got this little girl who looks more like an old man. Oh, no, she looks like a bear. <laughs> she has a bear face, and she has gray hair, too. And this is what her hat looks like. These are actually pretty cute and fun. And then this is the little outfit with paws on the bottom and there's a tail and it comes with this little pet which I guess it's a bear are these bears grizzly bear that's what people are confirming There's the bear's bum. And then what are these two tiny little things that are taped in here? I'm kind of afraid to take them out. Can someone welcome me? Caddy Noir Productions, thanks for stopping in. These things are so small, I don't know what to do with them. Are you supposed to put this in her hand like that, that white thing? 
Is it like a purse? And then what is this tiny red thing? I can't, I can't figure it out. Sorry, I don't, do not see any gray hairs in your hair, just brown hair. Well, thank you, Mandy. Uh, welcome, Caddy Noir. Maybe the tiny things are cell phone cases. Maybe. <laughs> or an iPhone. But I can't make them carry them. I'm gonna have to find out from uh, a, a my mini mixing cube. Now there's a blind part to it. Let's see what it says. Uh, let's see who the mystery character is. Doesn't look really scary, but it's a little boy. I like that. And wait, look at its hair. It looks like Chad Allen. It's Chad Allen Mixicue. And then, I don't know what it has, but it's got, like, I don't know if that's a surfboard. It must be a surfboard. Cute. I like surfer. I like surfer dudes. Oh, maybe it'll show me in the picture where to put the things. It should be easy to find the old man. And speaking of Chad Allen, look, there's a taco. That would be funny to get. All right, let's move on. Let's do another pony. <laughs> Who is this pony kicking themselves off? Very white eyes. Storm cloud. It's like... What's that character? It's like Grumpy Pony. And its name is... Sprinkle Medley. Medley. Sprinkle? Does that mean she pee-pees? Let's do this Super Mario Connects. Because hopefully, oh, I was hoping I would get Mario in a costume, but I can already feel which one it is. comes like this, but he has a giant hole in his head. I like him. I've been eating a lot of mushrooms lately. I eat them raw. And I take off the, the stem, and I put guacamole in it, and I eat it like this. Oh. I mean, that's normally how people eat. They go put it in their mouth. She sprinkles on the tree, maybe. Oh, grew at the peepees. I don't know what that word was. I like that too. It's groomba. Everybody's saying groomba. 
What's Groomba? Oh, the name of that... <laughs> the name of the mushroom I opened. <laughs> uh, I'm not all there, guys. What else can I open here? Are these all Monsters, Inc.? Because Monsters, Inc. counts. I'm going to open up one of these. I got this from... Boo, BB, Bub, Bubby, Blush, Moshki. I don't know how to say his name. Booby, Booby, Blask, Basham on here right now. Better known as Andreas. He sent these. These are probably like a European exclusive. These are the ones you can get. Look, I guess they plan on releasing more, but here are the eight that you can get. Oh, maybe I should take this checklist out. Here are the eight you can get. Which one do you hope I get? I hope I get... I don't, that red thing, I don't even know what that is. kind of want that. Oh, look how cute these are. They're different from the little mini ones that we have out now that have a few different waves. But great detail, really nice made. Nice German toys. Thanks, Andreas. You know what? I'm going to open up this Disney minifigure, too. I don't know how spooky it is, but... Andreas already also sent this. Here are the ones you can get. This was such a great series. When is the second Disney series coming out? It's Mickey and in a girl's costume. Sorry, I'm making I'm making a toy on here. That was an easy build. Oh, these are really nicely made. Very cute. Kind of remind me of Funtopia. That's why I'm happy to get these with the bigger heads. Wait. Fun... Fabuland. Where did I get them with Funtopia? Fabuland. An 80s wonderful animal Lego series. Kind of in between Duplo and regular Legos. Series 2 apparently is in 2018, which is coming very soon. To a toy store near you. You sure it's not Minnie? Oh yeah, it's Minnie! <laughs> Alright, what else do we got here? You know what? Somewhere I have a blind bag and I carefully chose the Surfer. It's like Series 3 or something. And I've never opened it. I don't think it's in here. I mean, it could be. Should I open this other Mini Mixicue? That's what I'm going to do. When else am I going to open up my Mini Mixicues? And in this one, it looks like there's an equivalent, like the Chad Allen one, there's a, there's a Two Hunky Toys one. And it should be because it comes with a monkey, my favorite animal. So that's right. That's his hair. And 
I'll probably keep him in that outfit, because that's better. But I'll show you what his outfit looks like. It's this. And it's so small that I don't even... I can never make out what the outfits are. But here is his little monkey. Isn't that the cutest thing you've ever did see? Which one is the two hunky Mixy Cube? Said it was this one. Sorry. It's this one. All right, next. Wait, did I miss an accessory in the last one? This one has even more accessories. I don't know why this one's... Oh, no, that's her outfit. Never mind. This little one with pink hair. And that really super long ponytail on one side. She's cute. Let's put some clothes on her. Hunky, Hunky usually has shorter hair. It's not short right now. I gotta hide it. Don't look. I haven't decided on what I'm going to do with it yet. And there she is. Again, I think she has a CD in her hand. Maybe it's a record. She's musical. And this accessory I do know. It's bananas. And that is my favorite food. Stay tuned. Maybe I'll have a contest one day and I'll ask, what is Two Hunky's favorite food? And the answer is bananas. And then the other question will be, what is Two Hunky's state of mind? And the answer will be bananas. And then it comes with this little green thing, which, is it a bar of soap? I don't understand these. I don't know how you're supposed to attach them. It does have an indent on the inside. I just don't know. Right. Oh, and there's a mini mystery pack. My mini Mixicues are actually kind of fun. I'm sorry I have not, you know, dove into the Mixicue action as much. There's lots of them available. I don't know where I'm going to find the Monster High ones. All right, this one goes out to all of my British fans. I know that there's a couple of you out there right now. And it's a little British girl. Oh, she came dressed in her outfit. I got to see what her... I got to see what her underwear looks like. Cute, cute. And I think she's actually Scottish because she's got red hair. Curly red hair. Really cute. Um, I mean Irish. Irish. I would like to get those aliens. They look really cute. Okay. Any requests of what we open up now? Okay, I'm gonna open up one of these Shopkins because I really like them. How long have I been on? She looks like Princess Merida. Wait, Merida's a princess? Open Disney. Okay, wait, I'll open more Disney right after this giant Shopkin. Oh, this is one of my favorites because it is a mirror, and look, it's kind of a shiny, reflective surface. These McDonald's Shopkins were the best Shopkins ever made. That's my opinion. Okay, have a lovely Halloween, Jason. I am going to sleep. Well, good night, Darren. Oh, he's in London. Good luck with the reviews. I missed 
to chat with you, but it looks like I could not have the opportunity. Big hug from London. Well, good night. Thanks for your long message. Reminds me of one of the Spice Girls. It does look like a Spice Girl. You say it's enormous. Are you talking about the Shopkin being enormous? Too bad it's not a real mirror. Yeah, that would be better. Except I would be distracted and then you guys wouldn't get any more blind bags opened. Let's see which one is in the blind bag. Oh, what a perfect thing to go with a mirror. We got a brush. Look how cute that is. I really do like these ones. And it's so funny because usually a McDonald's toy not into and even the baskets kind of, too bad the handles don't work but it's nice and it's a nice rubbery plastic it's not like that cheap brittle plastic that you usually get from a McDonald's toy I'm a fan okay okay somebody did say Disney so now when you say Disney do you mean like a mini blind bag do you mean like a Miles from Tomorrowland blind bag? Do you mean like a Finding Dory? I'm going to do a Finding Dory. In my, la in my last episode, I opened up a seal who had a number 13 tag on it. Hey, if you're watching this video and you haven't liked it yet, give it a little thumbs up. This is a very spooky black octopus. Oh, I really like him. He doesn't have a 13 tag on him, but he's pretty sweet looking. That was a good choice for a Halloween blind cauldron opening. What's his name? His name is Hank. These are the other ones you can get. I didn't pay that price for it, by the way. I think I paid... Two dollars, maybe less. All right, I had a Disney request, so I think they mean these. Ow. Um, that's my little mini Mixie Q. Looks like Meredith. People really think that. I will always love you, Jason. Well, thank you. You are a fantastic person. Oh. You must have me mistaken for someone else. It's Hank, but he is black. Yeah, weird, huh? But I like him better. He looks way cooler that way. I forgot his name. Usually, he is red. Just any. How many stuff is in that... A bucket. There's so much. It's loaded with stuff. Oh, I have to build this. I forgot. Oh, it's a cute one. But it's also very Halloween-y because it's an alien. What kind of alien do you ask? Why it's Stitch. Look how cute this is. So well made. These are so awesome. Lego is just, I don't know, nobody can seem to compare to creating things with Lego. Like, I guess because they've been doing it for so long that the imposters don't even hold up. Just the quality of the plastic, the paint details, they just look so good. This is so cute. So, so, so cute. So well done. Thank you, Andy, for sending me those and doing the work. We have these in Canada, but I am not good at this. It just takes me so long. I find it very frustrating. Oh, those bump codes are horrible, too. Okay, I'm going to open up this Miles from Tomorrowland one. 
Again, alien themed. I wonder if I have doubles of this guy. Um, this guy's name is... Gadfly. Which makes sense because he's got wings. And this is series two, I believe. And I really like Miles from Tomorrowland. I think that it's a really cute... I like the toys. I think they're really cute. I haven't really seen an episode. I'm going to make sure I open up all my spooky ones. So, let's open up this Monster High. Er. Oh, it's a frosty looking little... Her name will come to me soon. Her name is Abby Abominable. Sparkly. Look, the sparkles are coming off. Oh no. I don't like to get sparkleized. But she is cute. And she's in her pajamas, I think. Is that a cupcake? Is that a cupcake on her pajamas? Oh, it's an ice cream. Why, of course. Okay. You guys can request which ones you want open, but I'm going to look for more. Ooh, I got a lot of twosies in here. I'm going to make sure I don't have any spooky ones left to open. Yeah, I think I think I got all my Halloween covered. Wouldn't it be a monster short? I should... Happy Places Halloween one. Oh. I have a Happy Place... I do have a Happy Places Halloween one. I guess it's because I didn't do my haul yet. It's in my haul box. I have to open that one. Oh, my leg's asleep. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Andreas, for reminding me. Yeah, happy places, Halloween. Oh, 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 that went in my mouth. Oh, oh, leg cramp. I have to get, I have to get a better setup, don't I? Nice shorts, nice shorts. What kind of comment is that? Love your Minecraft review the other day. Thank you. I really like Minecraft toys. Shout out to Mike Ellis. Do I have any Minecraft blind bags? No. Those are blind boxes. Oh, this is exciting. I hope I get the punk the pumpkin. The pumpkin. The pumpkin. The pumpkin. I should have got a whole case of these. Oh, yeah, the box is cute. You can pop up the ears like this. They punch out. And then you can punch out the paws. Except, who's going to keep the box? I don't know why if you're supposed to do that before, but that's pretty cute. Hey! I'm a little kitty! I'm 
This is so exciting. I don't think it's a pumpkin, though. This is the platform. Does anybody know what room that is? I guess that would be like, I don't know. Fourier? Oh, maybe it's outside. This is cute. It's a little wagon. I don't have this wagon in any color. It's nice. Cute. I guess it's a driveway. Or maybe it's a nursery. Oh no. It's an outdoor patio. Cause then we got this spooky colored watering can. Cute, cute, cute. Very strange, spooky colors. And then we got this pot of roses or tulips. And you can carry them around in the little wagon. How adorable is that? Really, really cute. Wait, did I call it the wheelbarrow? Wait, that's not a wheelbarrow, it's a wagon. Did I call it a wheelbarrow? A wheelbarrow? That is cute. Hey, Jason. Hey, Jack. Jack. Is it sea pony season? No. Very adorable indeed. A gardening bucket. Oh. Okay. Let's see what I got here. I got some mini. I got. A Shopkins. I got more Shopkins here. Twosies. Twosies. Oh, I gotta open up a Twosie because I have so many of them. open up one of these other things too. They have awfully large bags for such tiny figures. Oh yeah! It's the alien theme that we're doing very very cute oh I really like these thank you Andreas um I just started yesterday I started watching stranger things really good speaking of aliens or other dimensional creatures but it's really good I had no idea it was gonna be that good I think the alien got hungry in the bag. And, uh, yeah, I got series two to watch. Probably I'll finish it tonight. Even though I should be doing reviews. Getting as many Halloween reviews as I can in. Want to see some of the toys that I wanted to review for Halloween? Let me show you. So, I have my Gravity Falls figures. I thought they would be a great Halloween opening video. It doesn't seem like I'm going to get to them. 
but those are awesome. And I have, oh, these awesome Walking Dead figures by McFarland. Those would definitely be a good Halloween opening. I have these little charmers, little ones, so super cute. They're little witches. Thought those would be awesome. These are bedtime ones. I am a big fan of these. These are made by Spin Master. So really fun to play with my Paw Patrol figures with. Friends of Ryder. And then I have these giant little charmers. That I really wanted to open to. Yes, I'm a little Charmers fan, because I think they're cute. And then I had this really cool Imaginex series that was a release of the monster. It was just one of the smallest series. I think it was a Kohl's exclusive. Usually it would say that on here. Uh, maybe Kmart. It was an exclusive, and you could just get that castle, which is a repaint. You could get this one giant box that was a collection of one carded version of all of these monster characters on it. But I already have those, but I still wanted to get the card one from my collection. And then it had a recolor of this castle item, and he was a blind bag minifigure that I also do have as well. But I probably would like to get it all. But the chances of me finding the rest of them is very unlikely, so I was just going to open this. But maybe now I will save this, not open it, and maybe one day the other two sets will show up, and I'll just keep them in package on shelf, and I'll just look at them and marvel in their beauty, gloryful, Imaginex wonderfulness, which I love. And then I have all of these Mega Bloks monster high figures so it's the whole collection of them um well up to series three and then some extra ones because we never got series four in canada yet i'm not sure if anybody got series four i just know that they're online and then i was going to review this sent by andreas again uh it is a Monster High knockoff, I guess, or maybe it's its own entity. It's Twilight Teens, and it is this a European toy, really cool zombie monster. She's got pretty cool hair, rounder head, really cool outfit. She'd be fun to open. Uh, I have this Monster High puzzle. I considered opening that one. And I have these Discovery Kids bugs. I thought that might be a really nice Halloween treat. And they can scurry around. That would have been awesome. Do I have anything else here? Um, the Ouija board. But I think I'm going to end up reviewing that. I might have to record that video tonight. But that's... Uh, my throat's going to be so sore after recording this video. I turn one of my Barbie dolls into Harley Quinn, a custom into Harley Quinn doll for Halloween. Yes, I saw that on your Instagram, Mandy. Good job. I have the Series 4 ones. They are pretty sweet. Yes, you get... Oh, I don't know if the boy came in in the, in the, in the, in the series. And then I have this, um, Monster High Minis. I thought I was going to open that in this video, but I don't think I will. Maybe I'll do a Monster High Minis collection video. My collection is pretty pathetic, but I'm getting quite a few right now, and it'll be fun just to do it.
Don't record the Ouija one. I'm gonna record the Ouija one. I ain't afraid. Uh, the Ouija board, I'm kind of disappointed. Well, I don't know yet because I haven't opened it. But I think I saw one in a secondhand store. And it comes... It takes batteries. So that, that kind of... It would be better if it didn't take batteries. Because the whole point is that... Yeah, I don't understand what that's all about at all. But the handpiece is not supposed to take batteries. It's just supposed to do its own thing. Kind of ruins the whole Ouija board thing. So if it starts moving, you say, Oh, there's batteries in that. Can you open once upon a zombie? Oh, and I also have six once upon a zombies? I just, there's just not enough time. Why would the Ouija need batteries? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what it does. Does it howl? Does it tell you how to move it? I don't know. They made it a game. It's made by Hasbro. The same people that have brought you Snack and Luke. My Harlequin Barbie doll that I made her a tiny little baseball bat, but it says good night on it. <laughs> Baseball, basket, baseball, baseball, but. I don't know anything about the, um, that Harlequin. I still have to see that movie. Would people recommend that I watch that? The picture of my Barbie doll is on Instagram. I know I saw it. Um, Snackin' Luke was such a funny doll to review. I know, he's awesome, doll circle. Look, I found a mini Mixicue of you. She's kind of close. She's kind of close. There's a doll circle mini Mixicue that I got today. I mean, the hair's not really red enough. <laughs> yeah, so I think that's it. Um, well, what, what do I, I got, you know, I got a few more minutes left, so, before an hour is up, we don't want to do an opening for over an hour, so I will open up some more of these, I can do, oh wait, I promised, um, I promised twosies, so let's do that. Here we go. Do you think it's going to be a Halloween twosie? So many, so many twosies. I don't know if I can open up a twosie in two minutes. Look at the background, all leopardy and multicolored. Thought it was a monkey darn so we got this little bear cub he's still pretty cute uh, if you go out in the woods today that can be creepy bears are scary scissors aren't very halloweeny are they i do have some scissors right here I have my lizard Halloween scissors. I could use them. Two minutes left. <laughs> Toosies are... You can't open up a Toosie in two minutes. And the one I got... This isn't one I have. I think it's like a possum head? What is that? A porcupine head? Is this a porcupine baby? Look, he's pointing. I don't know this pose. He's cute. Look how big his belly is. Adorbs. That was good. Um, I got... Uh, 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 something that I can open fast. Let's open... Let's open one of these again. And we got... Let's see who we got. Oh, yes! Because he's a monster. He's a perfect Halloween ending. It is... What's his name? Steve? 
<laughs> I, I, I don't know. But thank you so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And we will see you next time.